I'm going to try to change a toilet seat. Never done it before, but for some reason, well, hello, the dogs are going to fight now. But for some reason, they make them with a plastic uh, screw on the back now. And I tell you, a toilet seat doesn't last with this big behind more than about, I don't know, a year at the most. Here's my problem, I gotta get down on my knees and it kills me to get on my knees. I have a, two screwdrivers. I hope it doesn't take more than that because that's all I got. Ouch! Okay. Ow! Ow! <laughs> my knee feels like it's got a nail sticking through it. Oh! That hurts. What is that? It's not fair you get all oh, well, good. Well, just getting down got the thing off. That was a miracle. We're off to a good start then. It unscrews. Let's see if we can get it to unscrew. I think there might be a nut or something underneath. I don't know. Now watch me drop the screwdriver into this toilet. Even though I cleaned it. Well, I think that would just sit there and spin if I didn't hold that thing on the bottom. That's crazy, I think. Isn't it? Oops. <laughs> the little plastic thing broke. So now I can't... All right, you know what? We'll just muscle it off of there like that. Just break the son of a gun off. All right, now clean the potty. <laughs> How many times have I washed this stupid thing? All right, I'm going to try to wash this thing again. I do not know how people keep pristine clean potties. Every time I wash mine, I use it and it's dirty again. What do y'all do? Spray it with Teflon or something? I think that's a good idea. That's some Teflon spray for potties, along with poopery. All right, I'm going to clean this thing, and I'm going to come back and try to put the new one on. I'm back. That's as clean as it's going to get. So, uh, I'm opening up this new one. I know it's an elongated bowl. There was so many toys. You can get a potty seat everything from 10 bucks to 200 I swear. I didn't have any need for a slow closing one, although that would have been nice when I had my son living in my house. Um, but... I'm going to, I think this one's going to fit. It seemed it was $15 <laughs> plastic. That's why they make those plastic is so they break and you got to buy a new potty seat from time to time. I went ahead and bought a vinyl one even though I know it won't last long. I've had them before, about six months before the vinyl cracks out and breaks. I know. But I thought, well, for six months I'll be comfortable. Now, look at that. Plastic. Why? Why? I assume I have to pop these little things open. These little things that break in no time at all. These little tops. What? How the heck do you... What is there to this? I'll break it before I even get it on there. It, it, it just doesn't pop open like I was hoping. What? Why? Does it pop open from this side? Or does it snap open? <laughs> it seems to be a line there, but I think maybe it's attached. Try to go at this in some sort of a logical manner. You should be able to just pop it open, right? Right? Oh, it pops from the other side. No directions. They didn't say that on the directions. There was no directions. For $15, you don't get directions. I guess they think this is common sense. They don't know me, do they? All right, craziness. Okay, now, if I can do this without losing a bolt, I guess I just stick it on there, put the bolt, this may have to go through the bottom, the bolt is in the top. Okay, which means I gotta reach under and hold this steady while I tighten. Oh my God, I'm gonna have to pat my head, rub my tummy and do 10 things at once. I don't know how this is going to go. Either go easy or it won't go at all. All I know this is I'm worried about getting off of the floor <laughs> more than anything. 
Uh, you could use either kind of screwdriver on it. That's good. I have both kinds with me. Alright. Well, I might as well put both of them in. There we go. And uh, I'm assuming that the smooth part goes up. That way it'll press against the bottom of the toilet. How many of you would say, I'm <laughs> doing that? Well, I don't want to pay somebody to do something that seems like it ought to be so simple. Poppy told me to go, since the door's busted out to the garage coming into the house, permanently locked. He told me to take the door off the hinges. <laughs> yeah. Take the door off the hinges. All right. How do you do that? I assume it has something to do with the hinges. What do you think? Screwdriver? Pliers? I like the idea of a crowbar and a mallet. That might take the door off the hinges. Hey, I just got it to tighten down. Now if I can get it to tighten down really, maybe if it just real tight. Well, I'm real proud of myself. I'm accomplishing something really gross here. <laughs> now the other one will just go in. I'll be back. I'm not going to film me trying to get up off of this floor because I'm going to be doing a lot of screaming when my knees are hurting. Woohoo! Look at there. One household chore done by myself. Scud's impressed. Are you not impressed, Scudner? And it's all clean to boot. Bonus. Pop couldn't get the edge back on the tub, I see. It's uh, sticking out there. And he had to take it off to get under there for the plumbing. Oh, my. Maybe someday. Now, about getting doors off of hinges. I'm thinking if I tie a rope to the handle and then to the car and back up real fast, you think it'd get that door off that hinge? I don't know. Sometimes I go at things like that. It's a good thing I don't have a you know, chainsaw that works I could start. Because I could cure a lot of stuff with a chainsaw. <laughs> I found a Sawzall the other day, like those also, but the batteries were dead and I couldn't find the charger because I think I threw it away. It was probably in that drawer. Don't judge me. I told you. The minute I throw stuff away, I'm going to need it. All right. On to my next thing. I will show you that the hot water heater came in. Is not that a thing of beauty? Can you see it? There it is. Ecotemp, the future of efficiency. Look at that. And even prettier is the faucet that has the heater in it that's a 110. I just can't wait to, I wish I could put that on myself. But you gotta wire up the plug also. Oh, don't hiss at me, Hilda. Hilda's over there hissing in the corner. Well, well, okay. I have gotten a lot accomplished since I got home this morning from working three days. <laughs> Now I'm thinking coffee and a movie and a nap might be in order. Then I'll start thinking about other things I need to get done. I've already paid bills. <sighs> Off to a good start this month, huh? It's an even better start. Hi, Elvis. You drinking? You need a drink of warm water there in your heated bucket, honey? Who's a good boy? Yes, you are. Who's a good boy? Elvis is a good boy. Yes, he is. He's a good guy. Mr. Stinker. Oh, there's one of the BBs laying in the sun, enjoying where I plugged up all the holes going under the house. You like laying on that insulation? Is it warm? Probably is. It's insulation. That would make sense. There's Mama. Okay. Yeah. Here's the deal. Oh, what are you doing on top of the chicken house? Moon, what the heck? I bought grass seed today. A big, big, big bag of it. And I walked around the yard putting it down. I don't think you can see it with this camera. If I could zoom in, you probably could, but I'm on the ape man again. Uh, but there is seeds on the ground, guys, I swear. I'll get down there if you can see them. And it just about covered the entire backyard. Some of it a little thinner than others. Uh, I probably could use to get another bag and put another bag down, but it's a start. And tomorrow's supposed to be up to 40. The rest of the snow is supposed to melt. And then, um, I may go buy another bag.
what are you yelling about? You got food and water this morning. Everybody did. All right. Well, Scuddy, you look cute in your little bear outfit. Angus, tell everybody like, share, and subscribe to keep up with the insanity. Want give me a kiss? <laughs> How about you say bye-bye again, Mr. Wigglebutt? Huh? How about you, big man? You want to give kisses goodbye? Mm -hmm. You got a booger nose. <laughs> Getting a drink, too? You bet, Spats. Love y'all. Like, share, and subscribe. Keep up with the insanity. Did I say it before? I said it again. But it's true. Catch y'all later.